This video is gonna be about transistors and how they work in the system. And then I'm gonna demonstrate <clears throat> how to uh, build a transistorized circuit that'll work. <clears throat> so this transistorized circuit right here is working with an NPN. So if you remember transistors, they have, they're kind of like two diodes um, that have um, an extra N or P material on it. So this has got a negative and a positive and a negative. So you got a collector and emitter, which is going to be on the outsides and the base is going to be in the middle. If we look at the um, electrical symbol for it, your base is on the bottom down here and then your collector is going to come in and your emitter is going to go out and the arrow points in the direction of current flow. So the way this is wired up is if you follow the electricity coming from your ignition up here from your power source, it's going to come down here through a fuse. When it gets to this point right here, you've got one connection that goes over through the fan, over here through the collector, through the emitter, and to ground. So you have one circuit that's kind of going through the, the fan and going to ground right here. The other circuit, this is your switching circuit. So this is going to come over here. It's going to have a switch, an on-off switch right here. And then it goes through, there's a small resistor. There's always a resistor when you're talking about the base. And this is a one kilo ohm resistor right here. And so when you come down here, you're going to turn on and off the base. Okay, so what's happening here is when we turn on the power, so the power supply is on, this switch is lit up right here. We turn this switch on the fan starts up and runs because what we're doing is we're allowing power to come down through this line right here and it, it goes through this resistor and it powers up the base. Once the base of the transmission, trans, transistor is powered up, it gives continuity for the electrons to come through the collector and the emitter to go to ground. If we take this away, this right here becomes an open circuit. And so what we're doing is we're using a transistor to turn on and off this fan. And the way we trigger the transistor is with this little uh, switch right here. So what this boils down to is you can use a very small amount of current, like milliamps, to come down through here. And this circuit right here can use, I don't know, two or three or four amps um, to run this this circuit right here. So that way you can use a very small switch and a small wire and everything to power to, to control the fan where you have you need bigger wires and stuff to run the fan. So if you notice this is a NPN so the um, base is going to be a positive and so what we've done is we've got power right down here and we're supplying a power to the base. To turn it on. So with that in mind, let's take a look at an, a PNP transistor. 